Hello everyone, coming clean here. The last Skylanders game, Skylanders Imaginators, had a gimmick where you could create your own playable Skylanders called Imaginators. This is actually my favorite feature in the whole franchise and I have previously showcased part of my own Imaginators theme on my channel. In this video I will remake some pre-created characters I got on creation crystals I bought and make my own swashbuckler, ninja, brawler and bazooker. And yes, they will have their dramatic presentations. Let's get started. Of course my goal was to have all elements and battle classes represented in my Imaginator theme, but I have no means of resetting my figures, so I'm kind of stuck with what I have. Luckily enough, I did manage to at least scrape together all battle classes, and I have in previous videos introduced my Imaginator theme so far consisting of Arowina, the Fire Bowslinger, Sir Raptor Fang, the Magic Knight, Lady Smashinella, the Undead Smasher, Wade Wolfmouse, the Tech Gunslinger, Tenny Tide, the Water Sentinel, and finally, Feather Godmother, the Magic Sorceress. I am missing 4 battle classes, but I do have them all available to me on these used creation crystals, so let's go right ahead and start with this light crystal with a pre-created ninja. First of all, who makes a ninja of the light element? The pop culture version of a ninja is a sneaky assassin and that might be hard to accomplish with the self-illuminating aura and shiny white and gold armor. And a halo. And what's the deal with this backpack? Of course, you can make your imaginator look however you want, so all these are easy fixes to create a more stereotypical ninja, but all the light elemental powers are also, well, light based, so I have no choice but to steer into the skid. Lurking in the shadows That he creates himself with his perpetual self-illumination comes the sneaky assassin everyone can see coming, shiny shinobi. He will not be the last thing you see, because your eyes will be busy adjusting to the sparkling effects of its not-so-surprising attacks. As you frantically blink away the last sunspots from your eyes, shiny shinobi will have already disappeared into the darkness. Light disappeared into the light. And moving on, we have a crystal of the air element with a pre-created swashbuckler on it. This one had a voodoo theme, which is actually quite fitting for the swashbuckler that floats around above ground. I am not a huge fan of this movement style, but I do like dual wielding and I do like the air element, so I am looking forward to this remake. Let's go for something evil this time. From the depths of the abyss, where sharp looks and blades are equally important, emerges Demona. You will cower in fear of her intimidating armor and menacing horns that are also her ears for some reason. When you are cut to pieces by her twin blades of destruction or fall victim to a demonic bird bomb run, you will learn to fear Demona. And next up we have this dark crystal that had a bazooka on it. As far as pre-created characters by random stranger goes, I kind of like this one. It's some kind of reptilian knight with a somewhat subtle color scheme. I will however try to go for a more minimalistic traditional look inspired by Lin Fei, a bazooka from the fighting game Brawlhalla. Let's see how it goes. She may be tiny. She may be cute. But you'll regret underestimating Miss Isla. Her rockets will hit you wherever you are, but you will be wherever she pleases, dictated by the black holes she can create that will suck you into her bombastic mayhem. She also makes up for her below average leg muscle strength with rocket jumps, leaving you little room to escape the shrapnels of Miss Isla. Isla. And finally, we have a completely reset Earth creation crystal that was a gift to me from my viewers Michael and Evelyn. Very generous of them, of course, and this one would be the last battle class that I'm missing from my invader to seem a brawler. Let's see what we can make of this one. He's the king of the forest. He's the king of the ring. He is. Bucky Ramboa, 
A tree-dwelling boxer whose authoritative presence can command the ground itself to punch you in the groin, supposedly. He's got the eye of a tiger, the horns of a deer, and the face of the best thing available in the lack of faces of hoofed animals. Getting smacked in the face by the prancing, pummeling pugilist Bucky Ramboa is the last thing you want. If you like this video and the dramatic presentations, you may want to check out this similar video I did when I created the first four members of my team. Watch it by clicking on it now. That is how I reached this video. Thank you very much for watching. My name is Kami Clean and I will see you next time. Take care.